very happy. Too much papa. Toy Leo was my first grandson. Abogbo. Oh wow, Akin. I mean, he's probably known as Leo since at the time he had gone to the Big Brother house. He's an amazing and amazing human. You know, one thing I remember very well about Akin is that um, he doesn't forget stuff like numbers. I was over 25 years, or going to 30 years. I was going to 30 years, I was going to 30 years, I was Leo. Leo was going to 30 years, I was going to 30 years, I was going to 30 years, I was going to 30 I thank God for his life and uh, for the way he's been able to influence our young people in this church, um, creating leadership and uh, encouraging them to get their hands to do a few things. Uh, we appreciate all this and uh, it's very important to this congregation. Uh, Leo is accessible, he's available, yes. I met Leo in the church actually as a youth, very curious, understanding, easygoing youth. Even as then as a youth president, we were always together in prayers and so many other spiritual things in the church. We went to visit a friend of mine named Yemisi because I reached out to Leo for, to pay for our surgery, fiber surgery and um, he helped and Leo was like, you know, let's see this lady. I'm like, okay, fine, no problem. So we met and we went to visit her. And Leo is a cool guy. He's um, very humble. He doesn't put the celebrity status on his head. He's generous and um, he's just a great guy. <laughs> Mother Daniel, Mother Daniel, they were respectful. But in Daba, Oleko, Domoto Bono, Oden told you me that. Lati Kekere, Omadu have been your motto to pregate to to Dangadia. Hello, hello. You know, you go on the back thing. I'll to me. Like, you. He's one of the most intelligent friends I've ever had. Leo B is lost. He's lost. And, and it's because of his dream. That's why I love him. He's so caring. When you tell him about anything, he listens, he advises, he's always there. Financially, emotionally. Any as in, he's always there for me and he's always been there. He's a sweetheart, he's a sweet person, a sweet human being. Hmm, what do I begin? What do I begin? I've always looked up to Leo that's over. Like, like always I love the way he lives his life. Like I idolize him and everything is everything I have aspired to be for quite some time. Um, I was basically like a, a random fan. You know, I liked Leo from the Big Brother house. Then um, one day on Twitter, I just got a DM from Leo, like, thanks for the support. I was like, wow, okay. For the past five to six years, Leo has been doing well for the elderly citizen with little assistance or the other. I love each other I see a child or any children playing. And one thing I love about him also is he knows how to express his mind. He's always the type of person that will keep you in mind. If you do something he doesn't like, he tell you, Right to your face. We all were the same class. We learned, um, had the same experience in secondary school. We were in the same teams, sporting teams. You know, we learned a lot together in you know, those periods in our life. So I got to know um, about his ambitions, some of um, his views, particularly with respect to his love for sports. So he's a very wonderful guy. I call him ladies' man, but he's a very calm guy and very smart. So my favorite thing about you is the way he analyzes things. Um, you know, when 
you ask you about an opinion for something, the way they break them down. And you know, I I'd always be impressed. My favorite attribute the value would be his composure. You know, I, I've, I've spent time, over the years I've spent time with you, the way he carries himself, the way he's confident in himself, the way he's driven to succeed, to be a better person, you know, these are these are positive energies that one can easily feed off when you associate yourself with him. And even way before the whole Big Brother team came to came into the picture, you know, you has always been a real guy. You know, when I met him, I was surprised, you know, when I talked to him at one on one. How did you go here? He said, Come on, guy. I learned uh, a young man like me you know, is uh, running an election, so I have to come here to support him. I'm like, Wow. Leo came to visit me, festival period, and my children. That's how I met him, and after that, he has been coming to see us. Something that, you, that that's what you have noticed is that Leo actually came from the UK. Yeah, yeah. To be with us for Hawker. Like, he came to, he left the UK to be with us for our dream to try to build with us. So he has always been a friend, a brother, a mentor. Lovely one. And more than a brother, more than so, family, you know. Since secondary school, he's um, pretty much been the same. Um, go getter. Um, a lot of people thought he was overly ambitious, but now that he's been able to achieve a whole lot of things in the same spot, it just seems like he's just, um, he's just walked the Another thing I noticed about Leo is that Leo is quite confident. Leo is confident in not an arrogant way, not a cocky way, in a very subtle way. Ashley, I'm so young. I've done so much in this journey before being, you know, on Earth. As a celebrating his birthday, I wish him an absolutely long life, good health. Um, vigor, strength, more connections, more opportunities, open doors, and I also wish him every good thing that he, his heart desires. As since celebrating his birthday today, the advice I have for him is that he should keep on his uh, good character, should not change. He should continue to love God because he loved God so much. He doing good to humanity. I, I, I want to just keep helping humanity. I know a couple of people that Leo has helped and he's still helping and um, I want to encourage him to keep doing good to humanity. Okay, I wish you all the best. I wish you God's continuous guidance. Um, I love you very much. You are so caring, you are so loving. Um, I know that the future is very bright for you. I wish you nothing short of the amazing things you wish yourself plus more. You're definitely on the path to achieving greatness. I just want you to know we're proud of you. Um, all of us who have had the privilege of being in the same class with you, being in the same hostel with you, being in the same teams with you. We're proud of how far you've come for this um, period in your life. We are looking forward to witnessing some of the greatness that awaits you. Leo, for your 30th birthday, I wish you long life more grace, prosperity, and may the grace of the Lord be with you now and forevermore. Amen. Happy birthday. I um, love you so much, bro. Thanks for everything. Thanks for being a brother, a friend, um, a very, an incredible support system. All members are wishing you a uh, happy birthday and uh, many more glorious years ahead. In the name of Jesus, peace be unto you. Shalom. Happy birthday, long life and prosperity. Love you, Leo. Boy, happy birthday and God bless you. And Leo, please, where is the location? Like, I'm a hard time going out. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Ashe. Happy birthday to you. May the good Lord bless you. May the good Lord bless you. May the good Lord bless you, my dear. May the good Lord bless you. Hip, 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 hooray! <laughs>